You want it sexy, you want it cool, here is how you do that. Hello my beautiful friends, how are you doing? Today I'm going to show you a cool new method how to create AI images and I have an important message for you at the end of the video. Let's get started. So first I saw this method on the Twitter post of Apollinario. You might want to follow him. This is that method here where you can use all kinds of shapes and then it turns it into amazing images that follow that shape. Here is the page where you can do that and you can select between between these different shapes. You can also upload your own shapes up here by dropping an image into there. And then down here you click on run to render that. Here you can set a prompt and a negative prompt. However, there's so many people trying that right now. It takes forever to do that. So we have to ask Hackerman. What? What is that slow stuff? Not with me. Let me show you something. So instead of using that tool, we're going to go another route and we're going to hack that method. We're going to use control net for that and we use control Rollnet for QR code. Now, originally, this has been created to turn QR codes into AI images but we can use it for the same method. So down here you can see we have a save tensor file. Here is the download arrow. You click on that and you of course download this. Put that good stuff into your automatic 11.11 folder into the embeddings folder. In there you want to look for the control net folder and in there the models folder and boom this is where you download that. Next you're going to start up automatic 11.11. You scroll down to your control net and you select the QR code model down here from the model selection. Over here you set the preprocessor to none and you load the image or the kind of shape you want to have inside of your AI image and then simply use your AI model prompt negative prompt as normal. Maybe start without LoRa's and negative embeddings just to see how it works and then work your way up to that. And as you can see here we have a beautiful spiral in our tropical landscape. Booyah my friends! And there's another thing I want to tell you. Today I had a wonderful stage event on my Discord. Link is below where my community showed me their projects they're working on. They have amazing things, workflow for ControlNet. They train their own models and LoRa. So I want to put more of their work, their content onto my channel. Please join my Discord. There's amazing people in there and also join my next stage event. Probably going to be next Wednesday, 8 p.m. CEST. And for all you goofballs who haven't liked and subscribed yet, do that right now. Oh, you're still here. So uh, this is the end screen. There's other stuff you can watch like this or that's really cool. And yeah, I hope I see you soon. Uh, leave a like if you haven't yet. And well, um, yeah.